The smell of grease paint. That's hilarious. That is great. All right. Whoa. Where was that little rabbit? Rabbit. Hey, rabbit. Let's go, bro. Yeah. Let's go to the show. Can I go to the show right away? We're not far from Saint Denis, right? Well, it's kind of down here. This this place was insane. All right, so that's done. Um, we just scratched the surface of this town when we played on Friday. This town was unbelievable. Any critters here? Can't study. No, it's too far. What about these? Great blue heron. What's this one? Tricolored heron. Okay, that's a different one. I got a new thing from my compendium. Hi! Tricolored. Can't zoom in on those. I can if I get rare rolling block rifle out though. Study. It's the great blue. Train track does not seem like a safe place. That's ah, fine. Sathora! If Sathora never said anything, I would now have fallen. Just like the Oracle from the Matrix. Matrix. Oh my god. There's a gator over there. Another gator over here. Yep. What? Somebody needs help? Oh, oh, oh. Who are these people? Keep your distance! Enemies. Oh good. Well that was gross. God bless you, mister. Sorry, I didn't get here in time for your friend. Lemoyne Raiders. They're bad. Bad people. Choo choo. Gun oil. Don't tell me witness. Don't even tell me witness. That's a roseate spoonbill. Pretty cool. I love all the animals. Oh, Jesus. Except them. Oh, my God. American alligator. That was a three star. These are three stars. Perfect gator pelts, gang. Use a bow with improved arrows. Do I have improved arrows? No, all I got is regular. What else can he use? For a long scope rifle. Oh. Yeah. 
It's all right. It's okay. It's okay. He's freaking out. He doesn't like all these gators. All right, it's a perfect gator skin for crafting. Shh, girl, won't take long. So if you study them, if you study the animal, it tells you what what weapon to use, um, so that it doesn't hurt the pelt, and then you can use those in crafting and stuff. It's a gator. You would use a cannon. All right, there we go. Stow that. Three stars is perfect. Yes, as long as three three stars is max. All right. So we can go down here, and they have a trapper. I mean, uh, yeah, they have a trapper right here. We can put sell these pelts too. Saint Denis. Who was here Friday when I stumbled into Saint Denis for the first time? Like I, um, I am legit amazed uh, on like how it transitions to a city like this. Oh yeah, the surgery. The surgery was bad. But look at this. Look, look at the difference. And this is, this is even the more, like, this is just the outskirts of the town. It gets less muddy and more city-like. And there's a mix of cultures in the marketplace here. I spent a little bit of time this weekend just, like, walking around the, the town. Look at this. Look cool. So hey, good. Look out. Oh, everybody calls me stupid. Like, everyone thinks I look dumb because I'm like a cowboy and I'm entering a city like Have this. Good night, sir. Everyone, like, comments on my outfit. Welcome back, sir. All right. Oh, what do you have for me? So we can sell to this right, guy. Let's have a look. Yes. New Orleans. Where's the camp now? Same place. Um, perfect alligator. Can sell that. Perfect fox pelt. Perfect buck pelt. Perfect buck. Oh, here's the legendary beaver pelt. Okay, awesome. Boy, the things I can make with this. All right, so we sell that all to him, and then nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. What can we buy? I can I can get the badger hat, the fox hat, the bearer. Grenadier, Grenadier hat. What else can we get? I don't know if I have anything from any of this yet. What does the beaver help make here? I want to be the ghost right bison. I can travel faster with this stall and toll than you or anyone can. Two-tone moccasins I can buy. It's about knowing the land. It's pretty cool. Reinforced equipment, saddles. Perfect boar pelt. I got the alligator ranch cutter saddle now. Thank you for your help. Hello there. Gentlemen. Hey, sir. Sir? It's pretty cool, though, right? This whole marketplace, this whole town. Hey. Excuse yourself. Sorry. Hi, Snake Doodle. Hello. What's going on over here? There was some problem going on. I think I'm still Chapter Three. Chinese Lashanku restaurant noodles. The Jade Dragon Peking restaurant. Um, so this is the gun shop. Now let's see. There's entertainment. There we got this one over here. There's a show. 
maybe one of these shows will be our friends. I've heard. Order some Chinese food, please. Now you guys are making me want Chinese food. Look at this. Look at the architecture here. Yeah. It's fantastic. <laughs> All right, what is this? Excuse me. Would you just let me be? Is this guy? What is he doing? What's going on? Was that a robbery? I don't know what's happening. Someone help! Someone help. Who? Shut up and give me the money, fancy man. I ain't playing. Can I go in here? Sweet heaven. Oh, it's over here. I yeah, won't forget this. Keep running. Look here. Thank you. Tough. The hell? Is this the guy? Hey! I keep myself to myself. I'm looking for no problem. I'm the police. What? Wait, this wasn't the guy? What? That wasn't the guy? <laughs> I might as well I might as well beat the crap out of him now. Damn it all. Move on out. Let us do our duty. Okay. The hell? Please don't don't don't. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the heck? All right, I can't. I was. I'm just here to see a show, everybody. You don't want the law to hear about this. Get away. I just wanted to see a show. All right, hold on. Where can I? Do I have a bounty yet? I could pay off my bounty at the post office, but it's gonna be closed tonight, isn't it? Finally, a nice town, and you go beat some. I, I was helping a robbery. Change my outfit? Does that help? Does that help? Is that him over there? You have a problem? Yeah, I got a problem. I'm trying to save people's lives, and I get in trouble. Hey, partner. I didn't help a robbery. I helped the victim of the robbery. Holy smoke! Now everybody wants me dead. Why does everybody hate me? What if I just face my charges? You lost your mind. What are you talking about? I think I pull his gun on me. Yep. All right. What about the other show in town? Can we go to that one? <laughs> While we wait for everything to cool down. <laughs> Jeez. Howdy, friend. Yeah, but the fact that everybody knows I was the bad guy is the weird thing. All right, all right. Maybe I should just surrender. I'm just gonna surrender. It's fine. Hey, you don't belong here. You stupid piece of trash. You're wanted. All right, simmer down. Get them hands up where I can see them. I know that face. Okay, oh, I'm bringing you in. Okay. Hey, I'm bringing you in one way or That's another. That's fine. That's fine. Go ahead. Bring me in. Is bringing me in bad? I don't think I've ever done that before. What is surrendering to the cops do? <laughs> I 
I think I missed the show. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Minus four dollars. So is my bounty paid off now? Okay, no bounty. Sweet. I'm not in trouble anymore. Ooh. Yeah. Hey, Roman, what's going on? Uh, Marty Avifa, thanks for following, and Ranny Ann, and uh, Heat Check, thanks for following, gang, over the last hour or so. Come on, folks. All aboard. Okay, bounty was five, and I paid four. That's a deal. I know. What a steal. Um, so, theater. Can I see the show? Hello? What do we got? What kind of show? Ask for Miss Marjorie. Hey, uh, the performers asked me to come see them here. I helped them out with something up in Van Horn. All right, I'll let them know you're in. Curtain's just about to come up, oh. so why don't you take a seat, then come back and see me after the show. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's go see the show. Uh, main entrance. Sweet. Roman, I am having a nice day. I hope you are, too. Ooh, we can get a drink on the way in. If there was somebody here. And a cigar. Oh, that drink is just staring right there. Sitting right there. Can't really seem to take it. It is a fancy place. Oh, yes, thank you, thank you. Oh, where thank am I going to sit? Thank you. Welcome. Welcome, <laughs> Can I everyone. disrupt this? I am your host, Aldridge T. Abington. Thank you. Yes, Aldridge T. Abington. Few men have had a career more crowded with incident and various intercourse with the world than I. During extensive travel through this and foreign lands, I have procured a show so fantastical there exists nothing like it anywhere. Really? In an effort to bring this entertainment to even the poorest dreamer of dreams, I have determined the ticket price should be very low and the show held without a profit. To me, it's true. Okay. For it is blessing enough to bring these gifted artists to you. Am I allowed to clap? I met these odd fellows in a Woo! tavern in some <gasps> godforsaken place. <laughs> Entertaining cretins. They are quite a capricious bunch. Presenting Miss Marjorie and her medical miracles. All right. Woo! Well, hello, Sandy. Oh, isn't this a fine looking place? Now, they told me you were all dandies and dancing girls. Now, that ain't true. Antagonize. Without further ado, let me present Miss Marjorie's medical miracle. Bring out Bertram more freaks. <laughs> Bring out more freaks. as smart as he looks. Let's see. But what he lacks in brain, he makes up for in brawn. Ooh. Our half-witted Hercules is as strong as a bull. Ooh. Oh, he's sweet, isn't he? <laughs> you, sir, would you assist? Me? Hell yeah. Come on up. Oh, yeah. I thought it was me at first. I'm like, oh, no. Young lad, I want you to hit him right here, right in the bread basket. Go on, give him a real big suck. Well, I don't know. Oh, oh my gosh. The only danger it. is breaking I'll your arm. Get these weirdos off the stage. Come on, come on. Do it, do it. All, all right. <laughs> I am a large, semi muscular man. I can take it. Oh my god, what? <laughs> Sometimes he gets carried away. Bring it! Whoa! 
What kind of a two-bit show is this? Your freak nearly killed me. No, 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 no. Give him a wedgie. Cheer! I, magnifico the Magnificent, <laughs> and I have tamed a beast. Drop him! <laughs> God damn. Ladies and gentlemen, I, Magnifico the Magnificent, am a master of apparition. Nice chicken. These ain't no medical miracles. Dissipation. And even the art of transfiguration. Ah, transfiguration. <laughs> this is the best. This is Oof. the best. <laughs> I have mastered hypnosis, telekinesis. Oh my God, this is great. <laughs> and escapology. And now for my next feat. I will relieve Miss Marjorie of her frock. This Robio. What are you doing, you nasty little pervert? <laughs> Damn it! We were gonna give them a show. You're not like that. You're not. I give up. <laughs> Amateurs. <laughs> oh. Oh. So the show is a mess every time. Well, that's our show. See that? uh, thanks, Anthony. Five months in a row. The Shut the front door. That was great. Uh, that's hilarious. Kaya, thanks for the five months. Hype and love in the chat for Kaya. Oh, that was awesome. Oh. Well. Tiny people and tiny-headed giants, curious things. They are a delight and can make you money. So, before you snuff out that oddly shaped baby, bring them to me. Oh my God, that's horrible. That is I so bad. I discovered this next act in a tiny village in Italy. Truly, the most. I think he was. A, I think he was a plant, Rosewolf. He was a plant world. in the audience, don't you think? He was just a ten-year-old boy. I raised him. I bathed him. Yeah. I shaved him from head to toe. He is truly a wonder to behold. Presenting Benjamin Lazarus. What is this? and mystical prowess, my dear ladies and gentlemen. Now, it's unfortunate yeah. fact that in this mortal court <laughs> we are all born to suffer from all manner of maladies in daily life. Who here has not had a friend or loved one near death's door from coal gas fumes, typhoid fever, diphtheria, or the bite of a rabid animal? The greatest wealth is your health. All the gold in the world cannot purchase it, and yet it is the most delicate and tenuous of all life's gifts. And nothing knocks down death's door faster than this. <laughs> a man cannot outrun a bullet. Many fools have tried and failed in this endeavor, including the tonic salesman I caught petting my wife. <laughs> I joke. I joke. I joke. I joke. <laughs> I assure you, he has met his maker, and they are playing gin rummy among the molten lava of Hades. Oh, I have oh, traveled man. all around the world, this delighting young and old, with all manner of feats of amazement, but none are as dangerous. You guys as ready? This is gonna be dangerous. See what he has tonight. I will hand this Didi Packenbush revolver. Over to my assistant and stand at considerable distance across the stage. She will point the revolver at my head and pull the trigger using lightning quick reflexes taught to me by a tiny man I met in the distant Orient. I will catch the bullet in my teeth. Yes, my teeth. My teeth. To prove that these are indeed life.
five rounds. If my sharpshooting assistant would be so kind as to shoot this bottle of Lally Cola off my head. This is insane. Yeah! Off my head. Here we go. Careful. Yeah. I could do it a bullet in the brain right now. Okay. Oh my god. Oh higher. <laughs> okay. Me. <laughs> it's worth twice now, the price of free. Observe as I, the great Benjamin Lazarus, will do what no man has ever done and cheat death as if it were nothing. I just like that you can look at the audience and stuff. This is great. All right, here we go. What is he doing? Christ. He's gonna, we're going to watch him die right on stage here. Oh my God. No. He bit the bullet, yes. Chills, you're right. Yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's do that again. Hmm? All right. Hmm. Oh, I can't take Doing it. again? This one's a live one. You're pulling my leg. This is a bunch of dang balderdash. Oh, ah. oh, damn. <laughs> a skeptic. Hmm? I'm ah. And Benjamin Lazarus, I assure you, I am not participating in some hoax or carnival rules. Can you go up on stage These while they're doing stuff and like ruin it? Percent real. Wow. In fact, I challenge any member of the audience to come forward with their own firearm. Oh, I'm gonna do this. I will yet again display my uncanny skill to catch a bullet in my teeth. I'll do it. Is no one man sword. enough? Sword. All right, Fantastic. Yeah. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I will prove to you I am the greatest entertainer to ever live and the only man who laughs at death. Can I go up there? How do I go up there? Ready? Take aim. Or do I just take aim from here? And fire. Me? Just an illusion, after all. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right, I'll give him credit. I'll give him credit. I thought I was about to splatter his brains all over the place. <laughs> yes. Yes. That's crazy. A feat of incredibility. I told you that boy would bring you all manner of personal satisfaction. He certainly does me. <laughs> now, I discovered this next remarkable woman in a lost. Jungle. You guys want to watch another one or we leave? Deep in the wilds of I can't believe how many Columbia, shows there are. Where they do not wear clothes. She breathes fire. She yes, breathes fire. She does. And for those with the universal and not unworthy curiosity, yes, I can attest, she does emit fire. Okay. From almost every orifice in her body. <laughs> <laughs> what? Presenting Antoinette San Servino. Right. I can't believe they have all these shows in this game. This is crazy. Doom, 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 doom. Thanks, Accent, for the 40 months, by the way. Sorry, there was there was a lot going on at that moment. Thank you, Accent. Oh, 
I hope this doesn't go wrong. Cheer. Yeah! Fine lady! <laughs> How about that? How about that? <laughs> hey, Ventu, what's up? Oh, man. That's funny as hell. I'm just I'm just amazed that this all this is in the game. Like, like, you just show up to a theater and just watch this stuff. It's unbelievable to me. When chili peppers no longer do it for you. Gonna spit fire now. Woo, you gotta love yourself a fire. There you go. Right, come on. Come on, fire lady. Here we go. You're going to set the whole audience on fire here. <laughs> Woo! Hey, Hazard, what's going on? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. All right, girl. That's pretty good. Welcome on in, everybody. We got a lot of folks here this morning. My name is Richie, aka oh, Bog Otter. Wonderful. Oh, incredible! It's still hot in here. Watching the huh? uh, the shows in Red Dead. <laughs> incredible! Bravo! Though I must warn you, court her at your peril. She'll not nurse babies. She'd turn them into bacon. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. He liked that joke. Yes. <laughs> I discovered this next woman in the kingdom of Poland. Where she Phonies. sang by the roadside, Phonies. subsisting on coppers tossed at her feet. Miss Robin Koninsky. All right. Is this the last one? Thanks for joining us today. This here is a new song about a so-called modern improvement you may have become aware of called the telephone. The telephone. This new machine will carry a facsimile of your voice from I figured Bologna Twilight to Valentine to San Denis, and they propose to distribute them to all manner of places so that no matter where you are, somebody is looking for you. A wise man prayed that one day we may all eventually be gathered together in a heaven of everlasting rest and peace. Oh, you're right, Glamity. It's the lady from the stagecoach robbery. The you're right. The telephone. You because are right. Someone is always calling, saying, Hello. 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 I've got a little baby, but he's out of sight. I talk to him across the telephone. I can't see my honey, What's but up, he's John? mine, all right. This gal just can't leave a man alone. Every single morning you will hear me yell. He says, Hello, is it me, me you're looking for? The line. They connect me with my honey, and I ring my bell. And this is what I say to baby mine. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Send me a kiss by wire. Maybe my heart's on fire. If you refuse me, honey, you'll lose me. Then you'll be left alone. Your baby's telephone. 
Want to get up and dance? Hello? Hello! Your wife from Blackwater calling. Hello! Can you, can you stand in front of other people? <laughs> Wait, did they try to get out of your view? Come on, my stand right here. I can't believe they have all this in here. Send me a kiss, my wife. Baby, my heart's on fire. I can't. I always, I always hear the. Uh, I always hear the Warner Brothers frog, you know, in a tuxedo and a top hat coming out. Or the alien from Spaceballs. Hello. Hello. She remind me of my sister. Somebody shouts out. All right, let's go. Hey, Lego Warfare, what's going on? That was some show. <laughs> 